Hello guys, I'm back again to update you with the current trending and breaking news what is going on in Nigeria. So wherever you are, good morning, good afternoon and good evening all depends on your location at this time of the day. Alright, so you can see the headline on your screen and you can also confirm the date. Today is 19 August 2021. So um, bandit have abducted 10 students, teacher in Katsina. What if I tell you guys that one day these people may register this their business in corporate affairs in Nigeria? I know a lot of you would doubt, but don't be surprised. It's not a prophecy, but it may also come to pass. Okay, um, without wasting much of your time, I quickly want to update you. So you can see the police says the student on their way home met with the hoodlums coming into the village and the hoodlums took the opportunity to grab the student and they took them away on their motorbike. So that is it. Now, what baffles me is that um, this is happening in the um, Buari's home state. That is Katsina. This is happening there. And then um, so far, so good. They are yet to secure the release of, um, is it some polytechnic student where they release some videos, all right? Bandit release video that was as at yesterday, threatening to kill those students, all right? I uh, think the video is on um, premium times also. All right, threatening to kill those students if they ransom, I think about 50 million Naira is not paid. So the parents of those students, they are running around looking for money from the story I heard. The school have decided to sell some land, all right? The school have decided to sell some land uh, to raise the money for their release. Now, if this continue, is that not a business so lucrative? So that was the reason why I told you guys that these people may end up registering their business with corporate affairs. All right, let me know what you guys think. Um, we already see, we have already seen the situation of um, uh, the country. There in the north, bandit has become the business of the day. Those guys are cashing out almost on a daily basis, or should I say almost on a weekly basis. They are cashing out in millions, all right? They are cashing out in millions. And then the... Um, what has changed? Nothing. Now, taking us back to the leader of IPOB, Mazin Namdekan, when he was talking about all these things, all right, people were calling him fools and so on. And now that prophecy has manifested, all right? They were looking for him. Now they have gotten him. As if after abducting Namdekan or the leader of IPOB, everything will return back to normal in Nigeria. What has changed? Nothing has changed. So what was the essence of even abducting him? That is the question we should ask. Of course, even with abduction of Namdekanu, things are getting worse. All right? Things are getting worse. Now, this is not a story we should be hearing every day, every week on the um, social media. It is not good. It is not good for a country of about 200 million people. It is not good. And don't be surprised. There will come a time. Um, don't be surprised. There will come a time where these people will, you know, surrender themselves after committing all this atrocity. All right. Don't be surprised. There will come a time they, they will surrender themselves, you know, claiming to become um, repentant, claiming to repent. Just like what, if you check my previous video, just like what happened to uh, some uh, Boko boys. Just like what happened to some Boko boys. Coming out in thousand, sur uh, surrendering to the government. And the government, uh, Murik says, the people of Bono State should embrace them like their brother. They should train them. They should give them good care, good health care facility. They should build houses for them. All right. So don't be surprised. One day these guys may also come out with all the millions they have collected. I don't know what they are doing with money. All right. With all the millions they have collected so far, so good. 
one day don't be surprised they will come out telling you they have repented and what makes you think they have repented okay guys um i quickly wanted to do this quick let me know what you guys think if you have anything to contribute see you guys in another video